Good morning, this is Mr. Vasa coming to you live from Chinook Middle School. So first off, we have a trapezoid. Trapezoid kind of looks like a Pizza Hut logo. It's also a rectangle with two triangles on the side. So here's how we solve for it. First off, we're going to break it up into three shapes. We have a rectangle right here and two triangles. First, let's redraw the rectangle and find its area. The height is five. Oh, sorry, the base is five and the height six. Area of a rectangle, multiply it. Five times six is 30. Keep the units, it's gonna be inches, and all areas are gonna be units squared. Inches squared, boom, move on to the next one, triangles. We have two triangles. Base is two inches, height is six. Area of a triangle is base times height divided by two. Two times six is 12, divided by two is six inches. And that's squared. This triangle right here, identical, the exact same. So that's two inches, height is six inches. That area is also six inches. Now, and six inches squared, I mean. Now, how do we get the total area? We add it. Six plus six is 12, plus 30 is 42 inches squared. So whenever you have a trapezoid, split it up. Split it up into shapes that you know of. Next week, we're going to do composite shapes. You're going to be doing a lot more of this. So now we're going to move on to kites. So I need to go ahead and erase my board. Let's go over a kite. So kites look a lot like the ones that, you know, you might see flying in the park or in a movie or whatever. So that's also a combination shape. It's made up not of one, not two, not three, but four triangles. So let's say this is 10 inches, this is two inches, this is two inches, and this is four inches. Now we split up into not one, not two, not three, but four triangles. First triangle, height is two, base is 10. Two times 10 is 20, divided by two is 10. And that's 10 inches squared. This one right here, it's the exact same. I'll just draw it for you guys. That's 10, that's two. Area is 10 inches squared. Last one. Some a lot of times people have a hard time seeing these triangles. Um, this base length right here, just know that's for the both sides. Uh, let's see, that's two inches, that's four inches. Four times two is eight, divided by two is four. And the other one, pretty much the exact same. Two times two. Four is eight, divided by two is four. Now we just add it all up. We have 10, 10, four, and four. Four plus four is eight, plus 10 is 18, plus 10 is 28. So our answer is 28 inches squared. So what did we do? Broke up the kite into shapes that we know. Of. We notice off there are triangles, you solve for each triangle, then you add it up. So next week, we're going to more composite shapes. We're combining rectangles, squares, and triangles all together to make really cool shapes. We're going to be having to use this method of breaking shapes into what we know and then adding it up. So next week, we'll see another video, and I think we're going to host in-class video lessons on it. Hope to see you next week. That's all we got from Mr. Basic. So see you next week.